Hi, I'm Susie Slander, bringing to you another episode of Behind the Pros. Tonight we're going to meet with the much-talked-about rock band group of writers, if you will, the Rogue Gallery Writers, and learn about their highly anticipated new project, a novel called The Method Writers. We have been invited to join the Rogues during one of their creative sessions, and from what I understand, they're very serious and professional about how they handle their meetings. Let's go see. Looks like I came on the wrong night. I'm out of ammunition! You should have saved it! That's your fault! Ooh, I said not in the eyes! No fair! Like a true rogue! So, how did the four of you meet? Oh, you mean five of us. But I only see four of you. Rebecca couldn't be with us right now. Uh, she's Pragers. Okay, so how did the five of you meet? Well, we promised to never talk about that night ever again. Oh, good things happen to bad people. <laughs> <laughs> As the two senior members of the Rogues, how has the success of your first book personally had an effect on you? Well, frankly, we weren't prepared for the tidal wave of accolades and praise that we got for our first book, Writing is Easy. Yeah, a few people actually bought the book, and the feedback was overwhelming. One person told me they actually thought it was a good read. And another fan, they told me that they read the entire book. Well, almost the whole book, at least. As far as I'm concerned, if somebody gets past the first page, it's a huge success. Exactly. And I was flattered when one of my stories got quoted directly from the book. It was but, great. But that was you. Huh? That was you quoting yourself on your own personal fan page, and then you liked it. You basically quoted yourself. But that still counts, doesn't it? I guess. So, how did it feel to be invited to join the Rogue Gallery Writers? Uh, it was something to do. You know, they seemed a little pathetic and they aren't just jocks, so we felt bad for them. We think that they just wanted to hang out with a couple of girls. And how do you all get along? Well, we bring them some much-needed talent and they're a couple of egotists, so what do you think? We can't be in the same room for an extended period of time. Well, I'm glad I'm not a part of that. The rogues are known for their vast knowledge of literature and the English language. Hey, Jeff. Yeah. Is it I-T-S or I-T apostrophe S? No, Mike, I think it's I before T, except after, uh, oh, that's something else. Yeah, I think so. I don't know. Mm, me neither. Uh. The rogues are currently in the middle of one of their famed creative sessions. Let's listen in. What do you think about this, man? I think it looks good. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah no, that's fine. Yeah, that's good. I like that. It's a great yeah, idea. Awesome. You like that better than my idea? You yeah. never like my ideas. Well, ever. Sure you How do you manage to stay passionate about your writing? Well, I like to incorporate other interests into my writing. I'm a hockey player, so I wear my gloves while I type. That's ridiculous. How can you possibly type with those clumsy things on your hands? Look here, little Miss Know-It-All. You think you're tough? You want to throw down? Ah! Ah, she got me! Ah. Hockey player. Roller derby. Mm. Ahem. How has being a rogue changed your life? Not at all. changed your life. Cleaner and fresher breath with fewer outbreaks. How has being a rogue changed your life? 
I need to speak with the production manager. I mean, honestly, I wanted a stunt writer and we didn't get one and it shows. How do you think it would be, feel to be like a rogue? I mean, you've seen the rogues. What do you think? Ah. How has being a rogue changed your life? Wake up screaming in the middle of the night. I recorded it. You want to hear? Mm, yeah. That's what I did. That's, that's what I did. I can't explain. I think what we have here is a case of arrested development. Fuck. She's looking. She's looking. Are you guys passing notes? No. 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 Well, what's that in your hand? Nothing. No. He got that hand thing in his hand. Show me both hands. <laughs> I thought you were fancy. I did too. <laughs> Do you like me? Check the box, yes or no. Really? <laughs> now that we've met the rogues, let's find out a little bit more about their Method Writers Project. What is the concept of this novel? No idea. I'm just along for the ride. It's a group novel, and we each create a first-person character. And all the characters are going to be writers in a writer's group. Hmm, sounds familiar. Well, we'd be lying if this fictional group of writers wasn't inspired by our own rogues. And this fictional writer's group is called the Method Writers? No, that's what they become. These writers find they need a deeper understanding of their protagonist, or subject matter, and they apply it to their work. So they decide to get first-hand experience, walk in the shoes of their characters, apply the method acting technique towards writing, and things get a little out of control and all kinds of hijinks ensue. Oh, now I remember the concept. Please go have another drink and leave the talking for the grown-ups. So is any of this based on your real life experiences? Let's just say the lines between fiction and reality have become blurred for us. You're giving up too much information. Plus, you're showing on the big board. And there you have it. The Rogue Gallery writers giving us the scoop on the Method writers. Oh, that's mature. One. I don't want to do it. Three. Go. Ah! Thank you.